Thinking Machines, which is Meera Murathi's new AI startup, just unveiled its first product called as Tinker. So it's a Python-based API for distributed LLM fine-tuning. So unlike black box tuning services, Tinker is developer first. And let's tell you why. Because it gives researchers granular control over loss functions, training loops, and data workflows in plain Python while offloading the heavy lifting of distributed compute back to thinking machine services. So Murati calls it the frontier tools with clean abstractions. So you have control over your experiments without the GPU headaches. So it's like infrastructure meets accessibility. And at its core lies primitive commands like forward, backward and sample for custom training and RL pipelines. And then you also have support for small models to dense mixture of experts models like Alibaba Squen 235 billion parameter variant. Then you have the low rank matrix based tuning that lets multiple jobs share compute pools for cost efficiency. And it's an open source companion, the Tinker cookbook, which they've released with post training methods contains all of the implementations of the modern architectures. As former OpenAI researcher Andre Karpati put it, this lyses complexity better than upload and wait services because you get 90% algorithmic control and 90% less infrastructure pain. So top research labs have already shared their first impressions of Tinker because before launch, the API was tested at Berkeley, Princeton, Stanford and Redwood universities. So Princeton Global team, they fine-tuned a theorem-proving model with LORA on 20% of data and it matched a full supervised training mechanism. And then we also have Stanford Rotsoff Lab and they developed a chemical reasoning jump. IUPAC to formula conversion rose from 15 to 50%. And you have Berkeley Sky RL. It ran an asynchronous multi-agent RL loop, traceable only with Tinker's flexibility. And Redwood Research, reinforcement learning trained the Quen 32 billion model on long context control tasks. And researcher Eric Gann said that we wouldn't have trained this project without Tinker. So here's the strategy behind Tinker. Look, Thinking Machines just recently raised $2 billion from even 6 NVIDIA, Axel, and others. So with Mirati, John Shulman, and ex-OpenAI talent, they're betting on a researcher-first infra, openness plus public releases, and customizable models instead of one size fits all. And the vision is where a world in adaptability being the mode. So instead of centralizing power in a handful of labs, Tinker lower the barriers for everybody to run experiments at scale. So here's our final take. This is a philosophy because Mira Murati left OpenAI to build a lab that serves developers and researchers and not just enterprise buyers. While the skepticism was loud, the pattern is quite familiar. Every breakthrough starts mid, mocked or dismissed until it isn't. So if Tinker proves that their infrastructure abstraction can unleash new state-of-the-art results, thinking machines won't just be another AI lab. It'll be the lab that put frontier training into everyone's hands. So let us know what you think in the comments below. Thank you.